Yo, 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 what is goody, everybody? We're gonna start today's video in reverse because as you can see, I'm leaving the gym. But I just wanna let you guys know that you woke up today, I woke up today, so you know what that means. We're winning, guys. Tell your stress, tell your problems that they cannot phase you because you're already winning. Let's start this video. What's up guys? How's everybody doing today? So, I got a request. Someone wants to know our full workout, our full chest day routine. Uh, a lot of times I just show you montages, get like a pretty badass hip song in the background and just kind of just go through it really quick. But this time, we're gonna go through everything. So right now you just saw me warm up. Uh, we're gonna go and do the whole full chest day and uh, kind of like our whole routine. So uh, enough talking, let's get it. We got the jam up loud today. Let's go. First set? Yes, sir. What you going for? Six, hopefully. How much is this? 295. Let's go. <laughs> Easy, come on. Come on, Isaiah. <laughs> Come on. Don't touch it, get it, get it, get it, get it, get it. Ah. <laughs> Stuck. Dude, Damn. right there. So close. <laughs> so close. Whew. I think I waited too long on that last rep. Tired out. Yeah. All right, Isaiah, explain uh, how we uh, start our first exercise. All right, so... Uh, from previous weeks, we know where we left off in weight. And then based off of that, our warm up is 50% of our workout weight. So we'll do that for 10 reps. And then we go to 70% of our workout weight. We'll do that for four reps. Then we go to 90% of our workout weight for one rep. And then we'll do our actual workout. So last week I was at 295. I, ha I haven't broken that hump of hitting six yet. And we'll go from there. So. Uh, this is my second set. My first set, I got five and like got stuck on the six. You got about five and a half. Yeah, five and, five and a half. Five and a half. It doesn't count. So I'll be doing 295 again. And I have like terrible endurance. So I'll probably get the last couple ones spotted for me. Now, if but, you were to, if you were, if you would have gotten that six times, what would you have gone up? If I got that six times, we would have added a five on each side. So it would have went from 295 to 305. And then that'll be our new workout weight for the next week. Okay. And then okay. you always keep track of it on your phone or something. So you never backtrack. Never backtrack, you never have to question about it. Like, you know you should overload. be out there, yeah. Progressive overload exactly. and getting stronger. Yes, sir. Currently, guys, I got my power sauce right here. So I got two scoops of Keto Lift and a scoop and a half of Havoc Hardcore. I'm absolutely buzzing right now, buzzing. But I gotta go for a PR today. So I told you last week, I think I got up 265 for six. Uh, I need to get 275 for six, or at least get it for five reps, and that'll be a new PR. So this stuff's got me going. Gonna finish this warm up. A lot of you always ask me why I wear a belt on bench press. It's just habit, it's not helping me. Well, it's, it's not helping me on the bench press, but it's helping me mentally. I just like to feel that compression. I like that tight feeling. Same thing while I wear, I wear uh, wrist straps. I just like that, that feeling, that tightness, that compression. It kinda helps me uh, mentally get through the lift. So uh, here's the new benchmark, like I talked about last time. This is 275. Last time I got it up, I think, three times. So hopefully we get it up six, but anything higher than three, if we get it four times, is a PR. So uh, let's get it. Come on, baby. Come on, baby. One, two, three. Oh. There we go. I got it, I got it. 
Let's go, I one got more. It. Come on, come on, come on, come on. I got it. Come on, come on. I got it. Come on. Ah. Nice. Oh, let's go, baby. <laughs> uh, damn. All right. That was good. Don't cut it off. Don't cut it off. That last one was an absolute struggle. I will say this. All week, guys. Not not all week. The past weekend, especially yesterday, I've been dealing with terrible wrist pain. Uh, if you guys haven't been following me on Instagram or Snapchat, I've been moving out of my apartment all weekend long and all day today. My wrist is killing me. And like, whatever, the pain is, the pain is what it is, right? The biggest thing I was uh, mostly concerned about is like, damn it, is it gonna affect my uh, my bench press? Is it gonna affect my, my bench day? And uh, it didn't, so, but I don't know what's going on. Just terrible wrist pain. But it's not affecting my bench press, so it's pretty weird. But man, 275, we got it up six times the six rep was an absolute struggle, but we got it. Guys, we're getting stronger. One meal a day, 3,000 calories, keto diet. Where are you at, son? Where are you carb eaters at? Come on, Isaiah, get it up. Come on, come on. Come on. Ah, five again. Jesus. <laughs> All right, so 275. We got that up six. This is going to be my second set. We moved it up to 285. So. Pretty big jump. Normally, people are probably gonna ask me like, why aren't you moving up five? We're just used to moving up 10 pounds every time you get it. I know it is a big jump. Probably should be moving up five pounds, but hey, we like to move up 10. Let's go, man. Let's do it. <laughs> Let me put my belt on. Let me put my belt on. That's gonna help me this help me with this bench press. <laughs> Same thing for the reason why I chew my headphones. Just helps me mentally. Superpowers. Superpowers. <laughs> Electrical charges. Let's go. One. Two. Three. Oh. There you go. Go push. Alright guys. So I got two by myself. The third one I needed help. And the fourth one I was completely done. Whew, how stuff. Wakanda forever. <laughs> Wakanda forever. <laughs> um, want to talk about when you hit a PR, it's okay. So like that next work, that next set that I went up, only got it up two times. And I know a lot of you like, dude, only got it up two times. Let me just move down so I can at least get it up four, five, six times. No, you don't want to do that. The whole purpose is to get stronger. And yes, only even though I only got it up two times, that's okay. The next set, this set, I may only get it up one and a half times, maybe only one time. It's okay, guys. We're all. It's all about getting stronger progressive overload and just because you get up one time doesn't mean like okay I'm gonna move the weight back down so I can get up six times it's all about getting stronger guys. it's all part of the process trust the process let's go baby one two three Ugh. Another. Oh my God, I'm done, bro. 
Wakanda forever and ever. Okay, that concludes our first uh, exercise of the day. It's bench press, obviously. We go heavy. Now we move on to incline. And uh, we're still gonna go pretty heavy. Guys, okay, so the next workout is incline. So this is where me and Isaiah kind of switch things up. Like I told you before, Isaiah only lifts heavy. He doesn't go anywhere more than six reps. I only go heavy on the compound lifts, which is why I went heavy on bench press. But when it comes to our second exercise, I told you guys I go somewhat heavy. So I go about eight to 10. Isaiah keeps it at six, so he goes as heavy as he can. It's kind of like a mixture a of modified, modified, modified uh, routine, whatever you want to call it. Uh, but uh, like I said, that's where me and Isaiah kind of, our workout kind of differs. One, two, three. Two more. Can you move up? That was too easy. He recorded? Yes. All right, sorry. All right, guys. I apologize. I can't count, apparently. So Isaiah just told me I did eight. I just told you guys I did 10. We watched it again. I only did eight. So it was still too light. I had two more left in me. I couldn't hear Isaiah tell me two more because the music was going on. We're still going to make the jump, but we're going to go for eight this time. Oh, let's go, baby. Lightweight. Lightweight, baby. Oh, one, two, three. Two more. <laughs> That's all I got. It's not that big. That's all I got. Remember how I told you guys my wrists were bothering me? So they do actually bother me on the inclines. They didn't bother me so much on the uh, bench press. Oh, they bother me as soon as I put those down. It's all right. All right, we're on Isaiah's uh, third set. 115s. 115s. Let's get it, man. You're making me look bad, bro. <laughs> There you go, come on. Hey, leave one on. Are you done? Come on, Isaiah, get it up. Come on, come on. You better get it up, get it up. Oh my god. Hey, my heart wanted to get it up six times. My body said nope. All right, third set. We're gonna go hundreds again. We're gonna go for six reps. That sixth one was a grinder on the last set. Let's go for it again, baby. Oh, come on, baby. Oh. Whew. Let's go, baby. Lightweight. One, two. Two more. One more. Do another one. one more. I felt good. All right, so this is our third exercise of the day. Correct. What are we doing? So we're gonna do a weighted dip variation. So for a tricep dip, you're more postured up like this and then straight down. But for the weighted, we're gonna lean a little bit forward and then go down with the weights. So in, you're using more of your chest into this. So that'll be the next one. Okay. 
What's your uh, first set? What is this? Uh, three plates, 135, plus my body weight. And currently I'm like at 193 pounds. All right, so for those of you who are probably wondering why is Isaiah so much stronger than me, he's 25 pounds heavier than me. <laughs> That's gonna, that's, gonna, that's gonna be my excuse. <laughs> that's my excuse. It's my Rican genius. Right, <laughs> come on, come on, come on, get it up. <laughs> Done. Oh man. On this one, I do go six reps because we are going heavy. Now remember I talked about this not too long ago. The whole reason why we're going heavy on these dips is because we're trying to build up the bench press. Remember my goal is 315. 315 has always been a number I've struggled with. I can sometimes get it, but the times that I, I was able to get it, it's when I'm like really bulking, when I'm really close to like 185, 190 which I haven't been in a really long time, which goes to show you, I haven't been able to bench 315 in a really long time. Um, again, there's a lot of factors to that, but one of the biggest reasons why is uh, we quit going heavy on triceps. Well, I quit going heavy on triceps. So dips is one of those exercises that you can go really heavy on, really help build the strength in your triceps, which is then for is gonna help you on the bench press. So uh, that's why we go pretty heavy. This is why we go six reps. If I get the six times, we're gonna move up. Same thing we did for our compound bench press. So here we go. 115 pounds. Also, also guys, pray. Pray this doesn't hurt my wrist. <laughs> Please. Was that six? Easy. Yeah, that was six. Okay, that was easy. Holy shit, that hurt my wrist. <laughs> All right. So, we're coming to this point, guys. Now, you guys hear me say this all the time. If you're hurt, if something hurts, you're, you're having pain, I always tell people, stop. Stop what you're doing. You don't want to get hurt. So, I'm coming to this point right now. I need to make a decision. I just leave it here. I don't move up. Let my wrist heal or push through it, fight through it. Now that could be really stupid of me. I'm gonna go ahead and push through it. It's painful, but it's at that point where I don't think it's gonna harm my wrist. You just gotta be smart. You, you gotta know your body. Like I said, I can't tell you to push through it. I can't tell you to rest it. You know your body better than anybody else. I know my body better than anybody else. I think I can fight through it. Like I said, that last set went up pretty easy. The pain is only temporary. So after I was done with the set, it kind of throbs a little bit, but after a minute, two minutes, I don't really feel it that much. So I'm gonna push through it. But again, if anybody, if you're watching this and you're going through like a lot of pain and it's very painful, I recommend that you do not push through it. But again, I know my body, I think I can do it. Another six. Whew, felt good, man. Let's get it, baby. Keto gains. <laughs> Third set. Had a nice long break because I spotted somebody in the squat, so I'm hoping I get this six times. Let's go. Let's go. Come on, come on, come on, don't give up. You got it, you got it, you got it, come on. Come on. Come on. 
<laughs> ah, come on, bro. I was wrong. <laughs> Third set for Logan, moving up to 125. Try to make the changes in my phone. Uh, NPRs, Next guys. Forward. NPRs. Keeping track right there. Boom, 125. Getting stronger on keto. Proving the naysayers wrong. Oh. Last set. Oh. Oh. <laughs> Man, I'm telling you, it's feeling good. Weight's coming up, feeling great. Other than my wrists, I'll tell you, this 3,000 calories is helping. Oh, mad baby. All right, last exercise of the workout. What are we doing? We're gonna do some cable flies right now. And this time we don't go for strength, we just go for reps. About right, 10, 10 right. to 12. And strength. <laughs> Come on, come on. Squeeze it, squeeze it. There you go. Whatever I just said, he didn't get me on film, so camera guy, I'm about to fire this guy. <laughs> what I was saying is that I absolutely love this gym because they don't care if we film, they actually encourage it. They love YouTube, they love marketing. Uh, they're smart business owners. They know that whenever you film, you put stuff on YouTube, it's just good publicity. And they let me take my shirt off, which is really cool. Most gyms don't let you do that, especially corporate gyms. So, shout out to THRC. If you're ever in San Marcos, come by, tell them Goody Beast sent you. man what a freaking workout guys that was epic so we hit PRs and bench press hit PRs and tricep uh, what do you weighted call it? dips weighted dips tricep weighted dips uh, overall pretty good workout man yep uh, wrist actually feels really good so that's the thing guys it's weird the after the movements done my wrist hurts but then like a minute later it, it kind of goes back to normal so that's why i was pushing through it but again guys remember it's up to you only you guys know your body so mm -hmm. don't say hey i pushed this workout logan because you you know you told me in that last video no 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 i didn't i said listen to your body i don't want to get anybody hurt but um like i said overall workout was great anything you want to touch on uh strength wise because you are the strength you are the strength <laughs> guy when it comes to this relationship <laughs> No, I just always push for, uh, push yourself. I, the, the most important thing to me is keeping track of what you're doing. Yes, Because yes. you waste a lot of time if you don't do that. So by putting it in your notes in your phone, you never have to worry about like, oh, what did I do last week? Oh, yeah. maybe I did this. And then you rep it out like eight times. You're like, ah, well, that's a waste of time. For, yeah, me. for exactly. me, that's a waste of time. So I want to start like exactly where I left off. And like Logan said, it like just one rep better is already a, a game. So uh, he moved up a couple times. I got stuck on a lot of it, but they were, they were higher than what I did the week yeah, before. Yeah, so one, one rep more, <laughs> one, one, one. I'm like a half a rep away. Yeah, even if it's one rep away, I mean, any anything is progress. So take the little steps and build from there. 
to touch back on what he said, tracking, guys, that's really huge. Last week, Isaiah wasn't here on Monday and Tuesday, and so I'm literally texting, I'm like, oh, hey, bro, uh, where, where am I at? Numbers? Where are my, what are my numbers? Because I don't, he tracks, he's my numbers guy. I rely on him a lot as a gym partner, and uh, that's really key. So um, find a gym partner, uh, preferably find one who's stronger than you, and track your weight. That's the only way you're gonna get stronger. But um, that's gonna close out the workout. Also, guys, we got a major, major Christmas present. Christmas came early. Burr, 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 burr. Uh, Machine Fitness <laughs> sent us a lot of stuff, so we're gonna go ahead and open it up on uh, film and show you what we got. So uh, here we go. Nice gray package. <laughs> yeah, every time I see gray packages, I get happy because I know it's from the UK. So here we go. Oh, look at this, man. All right, all right. Let's see what we got here. Uh-oh. Oh, snap. Oh yeah, baby, we got some shorts. Perfect timing, man. Just in time for some, the like, summertime. Some gray ones, some navy blues right here. All right, he's got some gray ones right here. Definitely, I got some of these. So, uh, Machine Fitness, if you guys don't know who Machine Fitness is, it is my sponsor, guys. Machine Fitness, actually, um, the owner and the, his family <laughs> came down here uh, a couple weeks ago and spent time with me. Uh, we had a blast, we had an absolute blast. Mark, a legend. Yeah, absolute <laughs> legend. Look at these, man, epic shorts. So me and Isaiah are gonna split this haul. Oh man, look at these cutoff ones. Show the quad gains. All right, go ahead and open that one, brother. Oh, this is all tops, I can tell. Oh yeah, oh, so we got snap. bottoms. Look at that, man. Wanna open these up? Yeah, so open them up, man. Yeah, so, the, so large large is gonna be Isaiah. I am a medium, just in case one, some of y'all are asking what we wear. Black on built, a black on black Dude. tank. Yeah, I don't know if Train you guys like can machine. see this, but I love this black on black right here, man. This is super sick right here. The material is very lightweight. I don't know if you guys can see that. It has machine right there with the logo. Logo in the back. I, I can't tell you, it's like a stretchy type feel. Um, just, yeah. man, it feels epic, man. It's really good. What size is this, by the way? Large. Damn it. <laughs> <laughs> here you, go. you got the medium one yeah, right yeah, here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, there's medium one. Another on. stringer right here. Nice, nice. All right, guys, so we got another stringer right here. Um, so when Mark was here in the summer, well, when Mark was here two weeks ago, we told him, send us stringers, because you know, in the UK, guys, it stays like cold all year round. Here in the summertime, it, hot. it gets hot. Like there's just no way we can wear long sleeve, no way we can wear hoodies. So it looks like we are set, man. Look at that. Train like a machine. Man, man, they look this up. Dope. Here we go, here we go. Man. Also, um, if you guys are interested in purchasing, purchasing some of this, uh, I have a link in the description uh, below so you can get a discount. Bam! Look at uh, this. It's just like this. Man, this is super sick. <laughs> we could be twinsies sick. now. Look at that, bro. <laughs> I'm telling you, man, this material is super sick. It is. I love the black on black. I really do. Really big fan of it. Nice. Uh oh, the gray on gray. I think this is actually like a new line. Yeah, this, this, this is, is a, a brand new Yeah, this line is a new material. Out. So check this out. Oh, man. I, I, got, I got to bring this Bam. up to the camera just so you guys can see this, the detail on this. So check this out. Very lightweight, very breathable. As you can see right here, perfect for working out, perfect for running. I mean, this stuff is just super. Uh, same one, yeah. Awesome. Love this stuff right here. Yeah. Love this. This is my favorite. This is actually what I told Mark to send me. I was like, please send me <laughs> these. I love these. I wear these all the time. Man, it never ends. <laughs> I feel like the bag looked like this big when I grabbed it. Yeah, I know. <laughs> man, I'm telling you, Just Christmas came out, early, man. man. I'm telling you guys. All right, so right here we got the white on white. So I don't know if you guys see my black one like this. Look at the detail. Look at look at the back. Machine Fitness running down the back of a uh, your back, and that's just awesome, man. Super love this stuff. Super Another clean. White on white. Same thing on the back. Nice. I forget what they call it. Uh, Cause it's not the letters, it's like the, the negative. So it's written in the negative. So you there see you Machine Fitness in the negative. All right, one last shirt. Stringer yeah. right there. Yeah, same so. thing, look at that, man. This is just, it's just so nice, man. The material is just like, I'm telling you, super man. Super breathable. Super breathable, and it's not cheap material, guys. I'm, it's really not, like this This is on. This is probably better, uh, if not on the same par as uh, like uh, Under Armour and Nike. I'm, I'm, I'm not just saying that, guys, it really is. Uh, a lot of you always requested, hey, when are you gonna show a full workout with you and Isaiah? Because like I said, I always show montages just super really quick. I don't really go over the sets. We don't really explain too much why we lift it. We just kind of just, just breeze through it. Uh, but I wanted to show you why we, how we lift, 
why we lift it, and go from there. Yep. But that's going to be it, man. Lift with a purpose. <laughs> Absolutely. Lift with a purpose, lift with a gym partner, and track all your weights. Guys, that's going to be it for the video. I hope you guys did like it. Give it a thumbs up if you haven't. Hit that subscribe button. As always, guys, I love you. Peace. My face is covered up right now by two little videos, right? So I'm going to hop over here. Uh. <laughs> Next time, guys. Peace. <laughs> <laughs> That's what I noticed. I'm like... <laughs>